All right, hey guys, what's up? Steve Sleepy, welcome back to the channel. And it is an awesome day today. Today is Sunday, and I've been gone for about a week, kind of off grid with the family, living life large, having a little vacation. No cameras, no anything. I did not touch a piece of electronic gear at all. I played guitar, I went on hikes. We did all of North Carolina mountains. It was amazing. But anyways, I find myself coming back from the trip, and what is this weekend? It is the Superbikes return to Mid-Ohio. What? This was one of my favorite events. This is what led to the Mid-Ohio event that we love so dearly now. But it was uh, AMA Superbikes at Mid-Ohio. Well, Moto America finally returned to Mid-Ohio, and I had to at least catch the last day. So I got up early this morning, uh, meeting my friend Mark, who you might have seen riding with me before, Mark Ducati Mark. And we are heading to Mid-Ohio, and I'm bringing you guys along. I'm not sure how great a footage I'll be able to get, but we're going and we're going to experience it. So, hey, thanks for checking out the channel. Let's go to Mid-Ohio. Let me show you what I got. So weird to see the campground empty. Your need for flavor. Fully loaded tacos, fast wraps, pile high nachos. Whatever you crave, Mission will help you be ready. Quite the light crowd compared to what we're used to, but the weather is kind of shitty. But hell yeah, Mid Ohio baby, we're back. Water in action. I need this. I didn't know about the desert sled version. That's pretty cool. All right, so maybe we do the racing series in CF Moto. 135s. That saved money. All right. Electronic oil and suspension. I mean, maybe a 2024 will be a better idea. <laughs> so this is, this, is, this is what I would buy. I don't have one of these yet. Right here. Yeah. This is what, because right now it's either going to be a Panigale or this. I think you were right to buy it. I came so close to buying this bike. So close. But the 1,000, 1,100 got me instead. Mark just pointed out that nobody buys bikes anymore, but we do. It's been 35 years of bikes, 150 bikes. And I want that one and this one and that one. No kidding. That's like a foot and a half between the front four. Oh, look at the rain tire. Yeah. Mark, tell me about 
this? What was the series that we just Build Train Race. So all of the women that are in this series have uh, all of their bikes. They have to maintain them. They have to build them. They have to do all of their social media presence, all of their marketing, everything. Absolutely. And you can see when you look through here, all the different style bikes. They're all Royal Enfields. They're all the same model, but they have to follow the same guidelines. And as you can see, they're getting ready to go out again. They have to change their own wheels or do all of this stuff on their own. Get their wheels and tires loaded on the car to take to the uh, tire machines. So it's completely uh, driven by each and every racer. That's so cool. I I had no idea this series existed, man. Yeah, so that's unreal. And it's all about Royal Enfield. Yeah, well, it's all about it's all about getting women into the sport, growing the sport, uh, and Royal Enfield just happens to be uh, uh, the bikes that they use. Wow. That is awesome. Way to go, Royal Enfield. And way to go, girls. That's amazing. Good job. crazy mark was just pointing out that all these bikes that's all one piece and they take it all off in one piece the engine comes out in one piece maximize <laughs> i love this shit guys not gonna lie to you i could look at this all day long a lot of people out. It's making me happy. The series can keep going. Here we go. to go out and check it out. Just the race field. Just that blowing past the man.
Mark's over here cheating. That's the problem that he's going to have throughout this race. He's got to try to pass him like that. to see it in person. Go see it in person. I got a tattoo on my fat stomach. There's nothing like Superbike. <laughs> I feel 20 years younger like we're here in 1996 or whatever. Hell yeah. All right, that's gonna be it from Mid-Ohio today. We came out to see Moto America back at Mid-Ohio. It's been a while since Superbike's back in the day. Awesome racing. Mark came along and, and did not tell me he was driving, so I rode. Well, that's another story. But, it felt like the old days. The bikes are back, man. That was great. 185 mile an hour stupidity. And we loved every second of it. So, all right. If it works, it ain't dumb. We'll see you on the next one.